Oh, there you go. There's the magic word. The magic whistle, right? You ignoring me? <laughs> this is actually not good morning. It's uh, good afternoon. It's part two of day one. We just finished doing the joke of the day, and I guess it was, I don't know, Diesel, <laughs> Diesel didn't think it was funny. It was funny, come on. That one was sent into us. Don't forget to send your joke of the day to my Facebook inbox there, by the way. You might see your name in a video. So we are headed south, and then east, towards Wisconsin from Manitoba. We'll say hello to the state of cheese. Going close to Green Bay. Green Bay Packers. That's all I know from there. Packers. A lot of Packer fans everywhere. Packers this and Packers that. Green Bay Packers. A lot of people I know are Packer fans. If they follow the NFL. I don't know. Hockey season though, hockey season started. And the Jets beat the Kings, ha! Ah, Troy, you, we beat you, ha <laughs> ha. That's what I heard anyways, I gotta confirm that yet. We beat the Kings, who else did we beat, Diesel? We didn't beat the Senators when I went to go see him, of course, we were just warming up, getting the blood pumping. But, if I'm right, ha, ah, Troy, we beat the Kings. Anyways, okay. We are headed down to Wisconsin. Like I said, we're still 10 hours away at least. Just started this day, but we got a lot of filming done yesterday. Or same day for me, yesterday for you. We'll see you a little down the road. We're gonna stop in Grand Forks for a coffee and wash the window here. And as you can tell, it's a little bit dirty from last trip still. Yeah. Well, Minnesota has welcomed us with open arms again. We are on the Moorhead side of Fargo. Does that make sense? Fargo, North Dakota, but once you cross the border, it turns into Moorhead, Minnesota. Same city. Two different names. Just to keep you on your toes, you know. It's so boring out here, you gotta give two names for every city just to make things a little exciting. Uh, we're always going through here. This is a very, very regular road for us to drive through, coming from Western Canada. Going anywhere in the Eastern States. Coming through here. So, I'm gonna go under that underpass over there. That lane's an exit only lane, that's why we're in this lane. And then there's gonna be a scale. How many of you think the scale's gonna be open on a Sunday afternoon, four o'clock in the afternoon? I think it's gonna be closed myself, but we shall see. Hey, Menards! Save big money at Menards. Right? Do they don't want to go outside? Dad, I'd like to go outside. I go pee. I go, I go pee poop. Uh, I don't think everyone needed to know that, Diesel. Very important information. You want to go outside now? How about now? <laughs> Open the door. Dang it! Open the door! Okay, you, you wait there. Can you sit? Good boy, you stay. I'm gonna go out first. Okay. Stay. Stay. Oh, it's kind of muddy. How about you just go up by yourself? Go on. <laughs> Don't go far, would you? Stay over here. Oh, we're just on an off-ramp in Minnesota. Diesel's gonna go for his little stroll. How much long grass? Stay out of the water. I don't know if there's water down there or not. I've trained him to uh, dump in the long grass. That way I don't gotta clean it up. <laughs> Only the ditches and stuff. But he likes the long grass. Tickles his nose. Give her Diesel. Hey, stay off the road. Stay in the ditch. You know better than that. Oh jeez, he's going way out there. Oh man. Oh man. Diesel! Come on! Why do you gotta go so far away? Like he's gotta get as far away from me as possible to take his dump. Oh, great, where'd he go? Well there he is, he's back over here already. Oh I forgot his harness! I was gonna bring his harness on this trip. And uh well, there he found a good spot right there. 
And uh, what I figured out, I figured out a way off YouTube how to mount this GoPro to his harness on his back. So it's got a good view of the back of his head while he's walking around and running. We can call it the diesel cam. We'll have to wait till after this trip and hopefully I'll remember. I'm kind of busy. Are you done? Are you done? Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Are you a good boy? Can you sit like a good boy? After I'm done sniffing this gravel and tasting it, it tastes pretty good. Hey, Diesel. Hey, come here. Come here and sit down. Come here and sit down. Good boy. Can you get past me? There you go. Good boy. Oh, he's a good boy. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Don't forget to go like his Facebook page. You can find him under Diesel Weasel or The Diesel Weasel on Facebook. I will be putting a link to his uh, page in my description. I don't know if it'll be in this video yet, but in future videos. Till then, you can probably find him off my Facebook page. I don't know. Right, Diesel? Diesel thinks he's going to get more popular than me. He's already got like 700 and some likes on his Facebook page. That Facebook page is going to be more banging than mine. Stealing the show. What's your secret? Silence apparently is the secret. Apparently I should just shut up and stop talking and you guys will like me better. All right. Well, Diesel? Having a good day? What do you smell? What are you sniffing? Smell cows, don't you? You don't have to be ashamed of that. It's okay to like cows. I understand. I like milk. Cows are good. I also like steak. I know you probably just want to play with them. I want to eat them. Drink their milk. It sounds uh, bad when you say it that way. Eh? <laughs> oh, why are the windows open? Why don't you sit normally on your seat? Do you guys see how he's sitting there? That's how he sits. He tries to sit like me. He puts his butt on the seat and puts his two front legs on the floor. I know you're trying to be human, and you think you're human, but... Oh, sad face. Okay, fine. You're human. Got a joke for you. Today's joke of the day comes from Taylor Crankshaw. Taylor Crankshaw. This is a good one. Being a biker and a trucker, it uh, relates to me in two different ways. But it's pretty funny, I think. You're going to think it was funny, Diesel. So there's an old man sitting at the counter of a restaurant when three biker dudes walk in. Tough guys. First guy walks up to the old man, looks at him, and takes a cigarette and sticks it in his pie. Snickers and sits down at the counter. Second biker walks up to the old man and spits in his milk. Snickers and goes and sits beside his friend at the counter. The third biker walks in, flips over the old man's plate, throwing his food everywhere. Oh, and the three bikers get a good giggle out of this, and they're snickering, feeling all tough. And the old man quietly stands up without protest, tips his waitress, and quietly walks out the door. And the three bikers feeling tough still, snickering to themselves, say to the waitress, <laughs> Not much of a man, is he? The waitress looks at them and says, apparently he's not much of a truck driver either. He's backed his truck over three motorcycles. <laughs> <laughs>